guys, thank you for tuning in to another tutorial. This week I'm going to be showing you how to do a car logo flip in After Effects. First thing you're going to want to do is pull your logo into After Effects and drag it onto your timeline. Then duplicate it three times using Command D. I'm going to name my layers so it's easier to follow. First one's going to be Flip Layer. Next layer down is going to be Hood Layer. The last layer is going to be called Original Clip. Essentially what we're going to do is basically take our middle layer, the hood layer, and trim it to the points where we actually want the logo to start flipping. Next, make sure to deselect the visibility on the layers flip layer and original layer. Make sure hood layer is selected and grab your pen tool up on the top left. Now we're basically going to pen tool the logo out. Once you've got the logo pen tooled out, your screen should look something like this. Go to hood layer, open up masks, right click on mask one and hit track mask. This should open up the tab tracker on your right. Make sure it's on method, position, scale, and rotation, and hit the play button. Next, go back to your mask one and hit subtract. Now your screen should look a little something like this and the logo will be eliminated. Next, you're gonna wanna go back to the right side, hit content to wear fill. Make sure the fill method is set to edge blend and for alpha expansion, make sure that's set to 10. Next, you can go ahead and hit generate fill layer. Once this is complete, you'll notice that your hood is nice and solid and has no logo on it. You'll also notice that you have a new layer called fill. Go ahead and drag this underneath the flip layer and trim it to your same size as the hood layer. Now to the juicy part where we make the logo flip in the air. Cool, into the mouth. Nice. Go ahead and trim your top layer, the flip layer, to be the same size as the rest of your clips. Go ahead and right click it, go up to time, freeze frame, and there you go. Now we're gonna go up to the pen tool and pen out that logo. Preferably, you wanna be as accurate with this one as possible. Now, once you have your logo penned out, we want to set the anchor point of this to be exactly in the middle of the logo. If you don't do this, it's gonna mess up the flip of the logo. Now we're gonna make flip layer 3D by hitting the cube icon. Now go to transform and keyframe position, scale, and X rotation. Now we're gonna go to the end of our clip and basically keyframe everything again. Now make sure you set your X rotation to two. Since we set a freeze frame earlier, your logo is gonna be off center, so make sure you fix this. You can see that our animation is slowly starting to take shape. Now we're gonna animate our logo jumping into the air. So go about a third of the way through and keyframe the scale to be a little bit larger and make sure to put the position up a little bit higher. Now you can see that our logo looks like it's jumping up into the air. To make this more realistic, we're going to add a reflection onto the hood. Duplicate the layer and drop it below the flip layer. On your duplicated layer, open up the transform tab and go to your pre-existing keyframes. Now you're gonna to wanna to drop the position down as well as your scale and bring the opacity down as well. As an additional element, I like to add Gaussian blur to my clips. So drag it to your reflection clip and bring the blur up just a bit. Once you've done this, go ahead and add motion blur to both your flip layer and your duplicated flip layer. Just like that, you have your final flip clip. Additional thing that I like to do is go ahead and open up Premiere Pro. I like to add sound effects to my clip, so I went ahead and added a coin flip sound effect as well as a thud to the end. If this tutorial helped you out in any way, I'd greatly appreciate a like uh, or a comment. If you would like access to my project files, I'll have a link down below for you to download. As always, it was a pleasure showing you guys how to edit. Thank you. Peace.